Hello everybody, this is Sean, and I wanted to record a quick tutorial video today to teach you how I create smooth hills on my regions in Second Life. One of the questions I get asked by residents quite often is how I do my hills. Um, so I think this will be useful for a lot of different people. Uh, and of course, this video is inspired by Strawberry Sing's request for tutorial videos with her meme this week. So creating smooth hills. Uh, to do that, you need to use the Edit Terrain tool in Second Life. So I'm just going to right click on the ground in this open parcel and choose Edit Terrain. And what most people do is they click right over here to raise and they adjust the size and they adjust the strength and they sort of start dragging around until they have a hill that sort of looks like what they want and then they sort of lower it back down and shrink it and play with it until they get just the look they're wanting. And that's certainly something you can do, but it takes a long time and um, you kind of go a bit back and forth. What I prefer to do is start with a very flat surface and in the Edit Terrain tool go to Select Land. Now, I think it would be really nice if we added a hill sort of in the front corner of this parcel by the water here. So what I'm going to do is with the select land option chosen, I am going to draw a box where I want my hill to be, or rectangle where I want my hill to be. And I'm going to click raise and adjust the strength to about one quarter power. And then I'm going to click apply. And for every time you click apply, hopefully you can see it in the video, the land raises. And I'm just going to keep clicking apply until I have a hill that's about the height I want. I want a pretty big hill out in the water here. There we go. Something about like that. Let me cam around quick. As you can see on the water side here, uh, the terrain texture has gotten sort of stretched. It doesn't look very smooth. On the inside, uh, it looks smoother, but the overall hill is very blocky still. We're going to fix that. Let me add a little more definition to my hill before I get started. So I've got a sort of a dip right here. I'm going to go back to select land and join these two hills together. I'm just selecting there, going back to raise, and I'm going to go ahead and raise it up a little bit. Notice I'm a little ways away from the, board, the parcel next door. I don't want to raise their property up too much. Uh, and I want to give some room for it to sort of um, slope nicely down to the side. So you just keep selecting areas and raise them up until you get the look that you want. Now, as I look around, I've got a hill. It's still not very smooth. It's kind of big and chunky. Um, what I'm going to do next is go to flatten. I'm going to adjust my size down low, but my strength up a little higher. And I'm just going to sort of flatten out the area here. I don't want to take down the whole hill that I just built, but I want to give it a little better shape, a little better definition. So I'll come around over here and sort of flatten that out a little bit. And this doesn't have to be perfect right now. You can continue to play with it. Uh, I'm just doing it fairly quickly here. I'm going to come over here and sort of flatten this down a little bit. Again, hills in real life are rarely sort of the perfect domes that we think of. So play around with it a little bit and get the shape about what you like. Okay, that'll work for our purposes now. Next, I'm going to go back to select land. And now I'm going to start smoothing things out. So again, I'm going to click where I want to smooth things. I'm going to draw either rectangles or individual boxes. You just want to kind of work in a small area. Select it. Go to smooth. Adjust your power back down to between maybe one quarter and one half, around maybe one third in there. And click apply. And that immediately will start to smooth things. So I'll go over here and click there because I don't want that area to be smooth. I'll click smooth and apply. And hopefully you can see it getting smoother. Now I've got a big area up on top of the hill up here and I definitely want it to be smooth so I'm going to come up and I'm going to select the whole thing and I'm going to click smooth and I'm going to click it a couple times because I want it to sort of bring it down and really smooth it out a little bit. On the water's edge here I want to do the same thing. I'm going to select the area where the water is and I'm going to click Smooth. Now one thing about smoothing near the edge of the region is that it will, as you smooth, bring the side of the region or the border of the region up. So make sure you leave enough room. And really now I'm just going to sort of cam through 
and select the different areas and click smooth maybe once maybe twice just to get the look that I want um, as with most things in Second Life the closer you zoom in uh, the more imperfections you're gonna find um, nothing we can do about that but you can always just keep clicking smooth until you get the look that you want so it's not uh, there we go I think that looks good uh, so it's, it's not really um, anything that's too tricky to it uh, you really just want to kind of go around and play with it slowly don't don't click smooth too many times just click it once and see what it looks like and then click it again if you need to move the selection around a little bit so now I have a nice little uh, area in between this hill I can put some landscaping or a bench or whatever I want in there and a nice smooth hill that uh, flows down to the parcel next door and actually flows out into the water as well uh, and there you go that's how you can create smooth hills in Second Life I hope you find this useful I hope I didn't talk too fast uh, and I look forward to maybe doing some more tutorials in the future thanks <laughs>